too early for this. Hey guys, I'm Caroline. And I'm Andrew. And you're watching the snooze. Broadcast for the student and by the student. Let's start it off with some snooze news. Is your favorite candy possibly going extinct? The world's chocolate supply has been recently threatened with a new fungus called frosty pod rot. Now this rare fungus covers the pod in a white fuzzy coating that eventually mummifies the pod. Now chocolate is made from these pods and the more outbreaks the see, that we see, the less chocolate we'll have to eat. Now, scientists have seen outbreaks similar to this in the past, but since our chocolate supply lacks genetic diversity, meaning we only harvest a few um, types of pods, the plant could be especially susceptible to disease. NFL players are taking knees, linking arms, and staying in the locker room during the national anthem as a stand for racial inequality and violence. 21 NFL teams either locked arms or took a knee at their games this past weekend. Players from the Pittsburgh Steelers, Carolina Panthers, uh, Tennessee Titans and Seattle Seahawks decided to stay in the locker room instead of uh, going and listening to the national anthem. However, Steelers offensive tackle Alejandro Villanueva, a former Army Ranger who served three tours in Afghanistan, stood in the tunnel with his hand over his heart during the national anthem. And now for local news. Oxford High School has one more performance of the theater production, Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat, on Saturday. That's right, the show starts at 7.30 on Saturday and will be at the Kayla Mize Auditorium. In other news, the OHS swim team successfully won last Saturday's swim meet. The boys team claimed seven first place finishes while the girls racked up eight. It's impressive. Mm -hmm. Also, make sure that you buy your yearbooks today. It's the last day that you can buy them for $60. So after today, they will become $75. So you mm -hmm. can go to JostensAdService.com um, to purchase them online, or you can come to A222 and get a form from Miss Cheney to pay with check or cash. And remember that if you buy them now, then at the end of the year, people who buy their yearbooks will be able to come to a party that we have at the end of the year in May. Nice party. So come to the yearbook party, get your yearbooks now. Let's do that. My name is Marilyn Barnes, and I am the AVID Director for Oxford School District. AVID is Advancement via Individual Determination. It's a program that will help students get the strategies uh, that they need to be successful going to college, but they have to have that individual determination. They have to want to do it themselves grades five and six, um, it is operated as a school-wide program and then once you reach middle school and high school we have an elective um, and then some of the strategies that we will use are implemented mainly with our freshmen this year. Tuesdays and Thursdays we have tutoring and other than that we either are doing Socratic seminars or some other stuff. We go on tours, but we haven't yet, but we go on tours to colleges and I mean, it's not easy, but it's a good experience. Well, if you look at AVID's mission is to make sure that students are college and career ready, it matches Oxford School District's mission of creating students that are college and career ready. And it's one that's going to help close the achievement gap where we can get more students prepared to go to college so that they will be successful. It really helps you get your grades up with the tutoring and doing Cornell Notes really helps you get organized. It's uh, an event which will allow the teachers and the students to showcase what AVID really is. Uh, there are a number of people that have questions of what is AVID, what is it for, you know, what are they doing in AVID and this is a way for them to showcase AVID as well as have a little fun with the dip off and get the parents to bring dip and the site members will bring dip and we're going to judge a first, second, and third place winner. So it's a time to find out information about AVID as well as have a little fun. I like well, the fact that it helps you plan out your future a lot more. Because at first I wasn't clear at what I wanted to do or what I wanted to be, but now I'm certain of what I want to do. Welcome back, guys. All right, with homecoming right around the corner, we thought it might be nice to introduce you to some of our homecoming maids. But this year, we thought it might be fun 
to um, switch roles a little bit. So instead of the homecoming maids doing their own makeup, we thought we might let the escorts do that for them. I'm Lily Mitchell. And I'm Joe O'Keefe. Let's go. <laughs> I'm Zarya Metcalf, and I'm a senior maid. I'm Shelby Washington. I'm Kendall Madlock. I'm Jacob Melendez, and I'm ready to do makeup. <laughs> I'm Aubrey Kate Merrill. I'm Merrick McCool. That's it. <laughs> All right, so the first thing I have to do is apply eyeshadow. She's not allowed to talk to me, so I have to figure it out all on my own. Is this eyeshadow? All right, this is going to be interesting. We're starting off with uh, the eye stuff. I shut up. Okay, there you go. I don't think this is right, but we'll see how it goes. <laughs> About to be looking like Lady Gaga up in here. Stop! So what I'm doing now, I'm using the the brush technique, where you just <laughs> take the brush and you just just keep going like this until you get it looks like enough on there. I feel like <laughs> there. That looks good. Yeah, looks exactly like you're blushing. There you go. Um, I'm really confused right now, and I don't know what anything is. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so fun. Mustache. Jacob. Jake. Oh. 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 There we go. I think I'm done. Uh, I think. <laughs> Jacob! <laughs> what? <laughs> 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 That's terrible. Let me look, let me look. This is the saddest thing. But I was told to do what I wanted, so. Yep. I had fun with this. It was a good experience. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back and thank you so much for watching this week's episode of The Snooze. I'm Caroline. And I'm Andrew, and we'll see you next time.